Hey guys, it's uh, it's me, it's Maddie, and I'm here with a friend. Want to say hi? Hello. Hey. Hey, this is this is Dieter from his Yo. YouTube channel, Vitamin Dieter. Hey. Um, a friend of mine, and we are going to be doing uh, sort of like a drawing challenge. Mm -hmm. um, we do one on my channel and one on his channel, and it's essentially I tell him about one of my NPCs for a DD and d campaign and he tries to draw it and then he does the same thing to me and I try to draw one of his characters. Yeah. I think that's it. If you wanna, do you wanna tell me about your character? Oh, me, I'll start? Okay, go ahead, yeah. Yeah, yeah, you can start. Um, okay, so this character, I, I have him called, his name is uh, Deadeye. And, uh, Ooh. yeah. So Edgy. This, <laughs> this character, um, he's a dwarf and uh, he is, well yeah like he's stout he his main feature is that he's got like and a sort of enchanted uh glass eye he got it replaced by a like gnome enchanter um and oh a magic glass eye exactly oh, yeah. so he's got an enchanted eye and an enchanted crossbow basically so he's like a sniper of sorts so he's this, mm. he's this big stocky sniper i feel like i'm you might have told me about this character before I think definitely. Like when we were I, just I think talking. I, I ran, yeah, I ran him by you when we were just chatting because I was like, I have this interesting idea for a character, and I really liked how he turned out. So that's kind of why I'm like suggesting well, I'm him glad. right now. Yeah, I'm glad he uh, was, you know, good enough to use in one of these videos. <laughs> right, right. Hopefully, <laughs> being a dwarf isn't like because hmm, I know dwarves can be kind of hard. So we'll find out. Yeah, right. when you said dwarf, I was like, oh, good, the the one I'm bad at drawing. <laughs> uh, all right. So, and what do you got for me? Um, for you, I have Buckweed. Ooh. Uh, Buckweed is a scarecrow. <laughs> okay. I love him. <laughs> Perfect. He's very, yeah. very sweet, and he, uh, he's kind of just been stuck at this last, at this place for a very long time until the party came and found him, and he's like, can you, he has, he has a southern accent, Ooh. and he's like, can you help me down here? I, I would really appreciate that if you could just help me down from this pole. That would be nice. <laughs> so he was, stu he was stuck on one of those pole things. Yeah, he was like an actual scarecrow, nice. and then <laughs> he was brought to life at some point. Mm -hmm. To help protect a thing, Dude. I'll say I'll I'll give you this hint. He has, once again, poofy hair, like poofy straw hair, and he has a hat. So oh, perfect. All right, he's got poofy hair. That's the most specific I'll get. And a hat. Okay, and he's very sweet. You said. Oh, yeah, like he's very hair. sweet and innocent. He doesn't know what high fives are. <laughs> Is he like generally shorter or taller? Or... He's tall. A okay. lot of my characters. If I make a character, you can bet that they're tall. <laughs> I have like one mode for dwarves and it's it's the same like general shape every time. <laughs> Let's see. Big ears. That's a that's a must. <laughs> right. That looks like a that looks like a, a rat ear. That's, oh no. Is that actually? <laughs> oh my gosh, I just had an idea for a video. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Does it have to do with rat ears? <laughs> Slightly, actually. <laughs> that sounds really weird out of context. <laughs> yeah. but... Okay. Okay. Well, I got a general idea for his character, but now how do I pose him? I'm just gonna have your boy like stand in there. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I gave him a very <laughs> vaudevillian pose. <laughs> oh, good. <laughs> I love, I love Buckweed so much. Buckweed, that's a great name. Thank you. He was just going to be named Buck. Uh -huh. And then I was like, in the middle of doing something, and I like stood up. I was like, oh, Buckweed. <laughs> I don't know what he looks like, but he looks like a character. He looks like one of the seven dwarves. That's what it was. <laughs> if you would like any more details, just let me know and I can... Probably finagle some in there. <laughs> like, I'll come up with something. <laughs> yeah, something not too specific. Right. Well, I, I think I'll ask you more, like, around his color scheme, but mm -hmm. um, I guess for a general question, I, I would have one would be, like, he is a genuine, like, animated scarecrow, right? Or is he, like, a, yes. a character on the inside? All right. No, he's, like, an actual animated... What, what's the name for that? There's, an, like, an actual name for it. Oh wow, really? I wouldn't know that. <laughs> not like, no, not like specifically an animated scarecrow. Yeah, but... <laughs> yeah. I was gonna say like, wow, that's oddly specific. Oh man, drawing, drawing buckwheat hair, because I draw buckwheat all the time. Uh huh. 
Uh, and drawing his hair is always a, a different adventure every time. <laughs> <laughs> it's like I gotta, I gotta remember all these rules, uh, and implement. It's like each I gotta remember one. all these rules I know about hair, and most of them don't apply to this. Exactly. He's yeah. <laughs> Let's see. This guy's got a bit of a beer gut. I have decided. I've made an executive decision. He's got a mead, He's got a mead gut. So he is an archer, right? Not an archer. He has a crossbow. He has a crossbow. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Oh, that's right. Uh, does buckwheat have a? Oh, he does. He has a little axe, like a tr like a tree cutting axe. Oh, okay. Hmm. It's not very complicated. It's literally just like us, because I figured the rest of his design was complicated enough. Right. And I had kind of made it this like weird fantasy hybrid of like a, a random tree cutting axe and also kind of like a battle axe. Mm, okay. And then I showed my friend, and they were like, "It's too, it's too much. You got to cut it down a little bit." Okay. So it's just a normal little axe. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So it's, it's, it's like, like he got it from like Lowe's. <laughs> Did, I'm gonna go look up crossbow reference. Yeah, you do that. I am very sorry. <laughs> and... <laughs> that's, a, that's perfectly fine. I have to do it on my phone, though, because if I type in the letter R, um, OBS will be like, oh, you want me to stop recording, uh, right? Ooh, that. I like that. Ooh, I'm keeping that. That's a cool design. <laughs> oh, nope, I already got it wrong. <laughs> Whatever, it's fine. <laughs> It can be a like little you, stylized. Yeah, right, yeah. It's like, you, you'll you get the idea. It's 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 in there. It's in there somewhere. You just gotta look a little bit. Mm, you gotta find it. She's a little lost. You can bring her back, though. <laughs> <laughs> so how, like, how deep into the campaign was it until they met Buckwheat? It was only, it was a single session. It was a one-shot. Do you remember whenever I posted that, like, Halloween one-shot? Yeah. This is, Buckwheat's actually from the second part of that one-shot. Oh, yeah, and Buckwheat's also, um voiced by Puffin Forest. Oh, that's yeah. interesting. Yeah. It was really fun recording with him. Yeah, I think like on, on your first one, on the first uh Halloween thing, um you had other recordings, right? Cuz I I I listened to it and I was like this is really good. Uh Oh, thanks. <laughs> yeah. So, I guess like I don't know if you how transparent you want to be about it, but did you have the the voice actors like record their lines? after your players said something or did you have your players respond to the already recorded lines so what i did i just recorded um everything at the table and i was like the person i, I was just everybody mm -hmm. and then afterwards i took i wrote down everything that i had said and i, I went to the voice actors and they like repeated me but in the character voice oh uh, okay okay yeah, because, yeah, I remember I was watching it and I was like, wow, they responded really well to that specific, <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah. that, that one line. So that, that's No, it's not, we're not impressive or anything. It was just editing. <laughs> 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 the magic of editing put in buff Maddie. <laughs> right, right. If you want to get that joke, go watch Dieter's video. <laughs> <laughs> Right, right. It's like, um, um, now I got to give you something to edit. <laughs> oh, yeah, go ahead. It's go like, wild. Mm -hmm. I'll do it. I'm up for the challenge. Right. It's like, I gave you the challenge now. <laughs> mm-hmm. Go ahead. Oh, I'm, I'm down. Now, oh, dang. Now I got to come up with you something. You have all the power. You, do it. <laughs> you somehow still put me in the hot seat. <laughs> <laughs> I guess this would be... Well, here's the thing. On, at this point, we kind of like put your uh instagram so let me put my instagram on here oh yeah yeah go ahead uh well my Plug Insta your instagram yeah Yeah, my instagram is uh vitamin Dieter, just like my youtube channel um if you want to check it out yeah go ahead i put a lot of like um random drawings really on good there. art oh well, really thank you. good art thank you <laughs> you're welcome i love all of the things you draw <laughs> oh thanks yeah i put art in there like drawings and such um Sometimes I put just random pictures that I'm taking when I really feel like I took a good picture, which is rarely. But <laughs> if you want to see them, go ahead. <laughs> um, yeah, I just draw. I, I put up like stuff that I work on there and everything. But yeah. Um, so I guess now I'll be like, okay, now edit a scroll. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> no, okay, the, what's on the scroll? Right, right. It's like the scroll is opening, and it's no, 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 don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you want me to do an animation? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just joking around. <laughs> no, don't do that. I would feel so <laughs> if I watched your video and you actually did that, I would feel so bad. I'd be like, oh my god. <laughs> watch, you're gonna watch it, and I do it. I bet you I'm gonna do it. <laughs> no. <laughs> 
I would be like, what are you doing? <laughs> I, I would just like, uh, like, uh, I would, I guess, watching, like, watching myself from afar with no control over my body, watching myself <laughs> animate this scroll. I'm gonna be saying that exact sentence. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> I'm gonna be messaging you later. Be like, how could you? <laughs> Okay, let's see. I'm currently giving Buckwheat some random clothes. His clothes are also very cute. They're just, I don't know. They just, he just screams pure, pure innocent farm man. Okay, okay. <laughs> uh, some previews as to what happens with him, I guess, Ooh. because he was very, his role was small but funny. Uh -huh. Hey, in reference to that, uh, the, the Devil of Alder Alley, the, the Halloween thing that I keep referencing that uh, the Buckwheat is in, yeah, that... That isn't on YouTube anymore, um, so don't go looking for it. And the second part is never gonna be put on YouTube because it. I decided to take it down. I took it down for uh, personal reasons. Uh, that's all I'm gonna say about that. So uh, don't go looking for it. Maybe I'll put it on my Patreon when I make a Patreon, but that's about it. Okay, bye. Enjoy the rest of the video. Just thought I'd let you know. Okay, bye. He almost got exploded by oh. fire, which you would imagine isn't good because he is made of straw. Right, right. <laughs> there was, I specifically remember, because it's on my TikTok, mm -hmm. um, there was a specific moment where we're all screaming because we all failed our deck save <laughs> on a fireball, <laughs> on fireball <laughs> at level two. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I need to draw his hand now. I need to stop fiddling around with with the handle of this thing that isn't gonna look, this looks like a sci-fi weapon. <laughs> you know what? That's perfect. <laughs> Nice. Oh, you know, yeah, Deadeye, yeah, yeah. Like I was gonna Deadeye say, Dead has um, a sci-fi gun. Yeah, <laughs> Dead Eye sci-fi. Uh, what's it oh, called? Oh, that sounds cool, actually. <laughs> you right? That le the low combo, Dead Eye sci-fi. You gotta make more straw poop. No, that looks terrible. We gotta <laughs> go back on that. <laughs> <laughs> I changed my mind. Like happens frequently. Yeah, like that <laughs> meme where it's like, enhance, go back. So you draw your feet. What shirt should I give him? He has a killed, because obviously. Because obviously. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if you want to kind of fudge a shirt, you can just make give him a bigger beard. <laughs> <laughs> that has to like come down somewhere, so like here, and then the stitches. Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh, and it's a vest. That's what it is. It's a vest. <laughs> like, I got it. I got it. It's perfect. I got it. I did it. <laughs> Are you proud of me? <laughs> <laughs> right. Yes. Keep going. <laughs> I really... I'll give him like some pants, I guess. Yeah, that's what no, I'm No, he has a kilt on. He doesn't need pants. Right, right. right. <laughs> Just sleeves and a kilt. <laughs> <laughs> and a beard. <laughs> that's good enough. Yeah, I like that. Okay, time to line because I don't want to be shown up by you again. <laughs> oh. <laughs> no, don't, don't worry about it. <laughs> I am great. worrying about it. It's too late. <laughs> but, but I am. <laughs> when an unstoppable force meets an immovable object. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Like, which one will win? All right, let's see. Me. When your drawing exudes confidence, you can't be one-upped by your own drawing. <laughs> He's doing a kick line. <laughs> Buckwheat. <laughs> I feel like I should do something on this guy's head. He looks a little bit bald. He is bald, but he also looks... He looks like too he doesn't bald. Look at... <laughs> yeah, he looks too bald. <laughs> he can't have a hat because he also has a hood. So that wouldn't make any sense. Right. Oh, I mean, you can have a hood hat. <laughs> 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 That's where the mage room comes yeah. in. <laughs> oh, dude, I was drawing, I was drawing, uh, so, okay, have you ever seen Wreck-It Ralph? Yeah. So, you know, like, the King Candy set, uh, I guess, spoilers for Wreck-It Ralph. Um, <laughs> well, I don't even know when the last- six years. <laughs> yeah, it's been out for six years. Spoilers for six years, jeez. But, uh, so, you know the King Candy cyborg thing at the end? Yeah. Um, I love him. <laughs> and I draw him all the time. <laughs> one time, uh, a couple of days ago, I was sitting with this person uh, in one of my classes, and we had some free time, and I was drawing. Mm -hmm. And somebody asked me to come help with something. Mm -hmm. And I was like, okay, sure. So I got up, put my sketchbook down, and the person next to me was like, oh, hey, that I'm not, like, really friends with, but, like, acquaintances. Yeah. Um, and she was like, oh, hey, can I, like, look through your sketchbook? And I'm like, yeah, sure. Mm -hmm. And then in my head, I go panic mode. I'm like, the cyborg drawing is in there. Because <laughs> it's like really creepy out of context. Oh, right, right. It's like, I made a mistake. Did they actually, did they find anything, it or? Okay, so yeah. They, I mean, yeah, there's only like five filled pages ah, right I now. I see. So, so it's like, I know she saw it. Yeah, she didn't say anything. And that either is good or bad. I don't know. I haven't decided. <laughs> I used to hate drawing hands, but I kind of like it now. Yeah. Now the that thing, I actually know how to do it. Yeah, the thing about, oops, the thing about hands is like, um... I'm, I'm still not great at them, 
but like it's really fun when you get a good one Mm-hmm. So for me, it's always like I'm gonna try, and it might be frustrating, but when you get like the, that one good line, you're like, "Ooh, okay, I'm having fun now." Yeah, mm-hmm. and that then it's easy. Yeah, for anybody out there that's having trouble with hands, it's like you just gotta like sketch them out, I guess. Like I, I know that sounds super simple, but it's like you gotta have a couple failures while you're sketching, and then like that one good one, you're like, "That's it, I got it." Yeah, and don't be afraid to, like, erase entirely, like, everything yeah. you've done until you get the right thing. Yeah. Like, don't don't settle, you know what I mean? Don't feel, yeah, exactly. Don't feel like you're losing time when you erase it. Because at the end of the day, it's like, do I like this? And um, uh, if, if the answer is yes, then nothing was a waste of time. Like, my, uh, my boyfriend was, he actually taught me that. Or, he, well, one of his teachers told him that, and then he told me. Mm-hmm. Um, cause he's studying art. <laughs> Whenever, uh, he does like a good thing on his drawing, mm-hmm. his teacher's like, okay, cool. Erase it. He's like, what? <laughs> he's like, learn to not really be that precious with what he draws. Uh-huh. And if he needs to erase it, he can. Uh-huh. So I don't know. I've tried doing that and it's worked. So I don't know. Do that, I guess. Mm. Ooh, maybe I shouldn't give him red eyes. That might make him look a little Ooh. evil. <laughs> Oh, that'd be, like, a cute, like, juxtaposition. Imagine if there's, like, this scary, like, scarecrow man uh-huh. with, like, scary red eyes, and he's like, Hey, y'all, how's it going? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm going full in that. It's a little arrow, and he's about to, <laughs> he's about to stick it in you. A belt, because he's chubby. <laughs> <laughs> of course. Why not? <laughs> okay, let's see. Now for the color combo. Oh, boy. I'm not there yet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm probably going to cut this out, but, uh... I have that one song. Do you have TikTok? I don't have TikTok. Oh, dang it. Mm-hmm. I have that one song that everybody, like, puts to Pennywise that's stuck in my head. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. It's like... <laughs> 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 Is that the X-Files it's... theme? <laughs> <laughs> no! <laughs> you know when you zoom in on your work and you're like, ooh, this line art is way messier than I thought it was. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Buckweed actually was originally going to be an antagonist. Ooh, uh-huh. Um, and then I drew a picture of him, like, smiling, and I was like, no, this is it. Protect the <laughs> smile. <laughs> like, I got, this, this is a much better idea now. Yes. Okay, I think I'm done with the lining. Okay, good. Let's see. Ooh, maybe that, mm, that might not work, but let's fill it in and see what happens. I had exactly that same thought pattern. Whatever. <laughs> what was his profession again? Was he just, like, a mercenary? So he, he is, like, a, uh, I guess to, to go more into the lore I created, he is a, like, a, a hunter-capturer. Um, Ooh. Because what he works in is um, his town, or his city, I guess, started really um, valuing, like, blacksmiths and weaponsmiths and so because of that um their town really has a sort of celebration every like month every like once a month um to sort of have this contest in a big arena where people can come in and fight uh creatures and monsters that people have gone out to capture and oh, cool! The purpose of the the purpose of the arena is to show off what each blacksmith has created um, with a warrior. So, like the blacksmiths in this city have a sort of contract with people that want to fight in the arena, um, and the contract is like, you show off my weapons, you show off what I make, um, and you can take a percentage off of anything that you want me to make to bring in more like clientele to my um ta- to my shop uh yeah and if you win like the arena you'll make my shop look more appealing because it's like the things i make are way better because you're winning so people are going to want to come in and actually buy my stuff and so that's nice i like that yeah thanks i, I really a really cool world building yeah thank you i really like actually had to sit down and think like what what reasons do I have for this? So, yeah. yeah, I want to have a cool arena arc. How do I exactly? Do that? <laughs> yeah. And um, he is the kind. He's the person that just goes out to like capture any creatures that he um, finds like valuable enough to fight. And uh, mm. okay, so that's cool. why that's like why they that. that's why like my party was helping him capture a bugbear with buckwheat. You were saying that uh, so he's like helping out the your your character's party right now or 
Yeah, so originally he was part of a cult. Uh-huh. Um, and they put him there to protect the hideout of the cult. Um, but he hasn't had to do anything in 10 years, and he's really bored, and he's had a lot of time to sit down and think uh-huh. about the morals of those actions. Uh-huh. And he doesn't, you know, he, does, he doesn't think he quite lacks exactly what them, what them devil men are doing over there. Uh-huh. <laughs> he's precious. There's one party member who's a baby, and the others are like the people who stop him from catching himself on fire constantly. Uh-huh. That one time when they didn't. Where everyone got on fire. <laughs> anyway, watch the video to see what I'm talking about, I guess. I don't know. Got a nice little teaser. Hopefully it's up by now. It won't be. <laughs> oh, dang it. What happened? I'm putting two colors next to each other. I can't do that. <laughs> I can't do that. No, wait, this this skin tone looks so good though. <laughs> it's like, I like this. <sighs> I gotta change too much now. Yeah, I don't wanna change that much. Yeah. This looks rad. I might make the skin tone work with it, I guess. <laughs> I can't. The skin tone's the same color as the thing. Oh, no. Man. Okay, let's not worry about yeah, it right Yeah, now. yeah, yeah, yeah. I made him a little top-heavy. That's okay. He's fine. <laughs> He's a little top-heavy in my drawings, too. <laughs> He's just skipping along with a big axe on in his head. Aw, it's so cute. <laughs> and very character-appropriate. <laughs> All right, let's see. I've got reds and stuff going on, so let's try a little blue. Oh, what a coincidence. So do I. <laughs> kind of gotten over that whole thing where it's like i don't want people to watch me draw because that's de- really? that's definitely like uh an idea you have while you're like learning to draw because you kind of feel pressured i guess um yeah but i mean like we're having people basically watch us right now so <laughs> hey guys <laughs> like, that was oh, a no. panic attack i, was, <laughs> I didn't know that <laughs> <laughs> Whenever I made my first like D and D story video, mm-hmm. somebody uh, in real life like told me that I shouldn't draw my hands like that because I look like a frog. Oh, uh-huh. and, and I was like, wait, but I liked it like that. Uh-huh. <laughs> like I like those hands. Maybe I like looking like a frog. <laughs> <laughs> what if I want to be a frog? I recently started like uh, sketching people out in public, like in cafes and stuff. Oh, cool. And let me tell you, it's really it's a weird feeling because. Uh-huh. It's like, I'm very worried that somebody's gonna like, see me do it mm-hmm. and like, think I'm weird mm-hmm. for drawing them and be creeped out. Yeah. You know, sometimes I feel like we need to have like a badge that just says like, art, yeah. art pass. So you can be like, <laughs> if someone sees you like- There needs to be a federal license exactly. to get to like- <laughs> Or it's like, if someone ever sees you staring at then you can be like, don't worry, I'm an artist. This is for research. <laughs> yeah. Actually, you know what's really funny? What was that? Um, Buckweed's hairstyle was based off of this random guy I saw at the DMV one time. Oh, okay. Oh, and no, I, I hope being, I like, did it justice. I have to use... <laughs> <laughs> I have to do this. Uh-huh. I have to make you into something, sir. You're wonderful. <laughs> yeah, I remember one time I was, like, I was at an In-N-Out, and, um, I saw this guy, like, pass by, and I was like, wow, I can't tell him this, but he's got a real villainous look. Oh my gosh! <laughs> I saw him and I was like, that that guy has the perfect face for a villain. But it's like, if someone were to walk up to you and tell you <laughs> yeah. that, it's kind of like... I don't know how I would take that. Yeah, it's like, um, okay, sir. Like, Thanks. One of the people I was trying to draw, he was in like, he was sitting in this like weird, relaxed, like, hunched over position. I was like, oh, I'll draw you. Mm-hmm. So his back was turned and I was like, perfect. Uh-huh. So, but then like... A couple of other people sat down, and uh, they were, like, facing me. Uh-huh. <laughs> and they were with him. Mm-hmm. I was like, crap! <laughs> so, I hid behind my shopping bag. <laughs> you know, like a coward. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <laughs> okay, I'm done. Okay, cool. I lied, I wasn't done. <laughs> I'm gonna post some bushes, because he goes into the forest and gets animals. Stuff. Yeah, he's capturing them. Hey, buddy, can you select that color for me? <laughs> That'd be awesome. Hey, bud, could you select that color for me? I would love it if you would just cooperate, please. Thank you. Okay, I'm actually done now. Okay, saving over. My last save. Wait, why is it untitled? What's his name again? Deadeye. Yeah, Deadeye. Deadeye. It's a double pun because he's got a dead eye and he's a dead eye shot. Oh, I never gave him anything on his head. Oops. He still looks like a peanut. That's fine. <laughs> oh, the other cut. Tell me when you're ready to uh, post it. There we go. Oh my gosh, he's precious. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
I love him so much. <laughs> Thanks. I, Look at my baby. <laughs> he's just skipping along. I can see your. Uh, I, I really like the gut you gave him too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and the yeah that that eye that glass eye. Good job on the crossbow too. Thanks. I would. I was like worried. I would have been worried myself to do that. <laughs> I think I got the essence. It's yeah. definitely not like a good crossbow. It's definitely too small. Right. But... You chose. You know what? You chose the perfect perspective <laughs> to like yeah. cover up the, the parts you don't want to draw. Yeah. Yeah. Main, mainly the trigger. Yeah. <laughs> the yeah. Trigger yeah, yeah. area. No, I really like this though. This is definitely great. I like his little beard. Oh, I just realized the shadow is kind of on top of the bushes, but that's okay. We, we don't mind that. <laughs> no, we'll just say that's that's bush on the or that shadow on the bush. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was I was having trouble with uh, uh, buckwheat's uh, colors too, so I hope I was like, mm. how are your lines so clean? <laughs> uh, how is this possible? <laughs> <laughs> In this short of amount of time. <laughs> I mean, I. Well, I guess that's one other tip I can leave you guys with. Like, uh, if you want clean line art, just kind of like uh, do it quickly, uh, if that makes sense. Like, <laughs> just do it. <laughs> <laughs> just be, just be no okay way. at it. God, no, no, like, like draw, draw your. It's brush. not that hard. <laughs> it's not that hard. <laughs> just grab, like, yeah, draw your brush, like, and like sw do a big swoosh. Instead of like tiny swooshes, do big swooshes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking specifically like you ever you ever seen an artwork and you're like there's a there's like one part of it that you're like that's amazing. Oh. I like that one part, uh -huh. that little part right there. I love his hair. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, it's so cute was, and perfect. I was really trying. I was like, I gotta make this like poofy. Let me see if I can find the actual picture. Oh yeah, here it is. Let me see it. I should have told you he's less boyish in real life than what I had shown oh. than what I had told you I probably Okay. He's more of a he's less of a farm boy and more of a farm man. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> the, the next evolution. He has he has McGucket energy. <laughs> mm, okay. Oh, I see. Yeah, here's Buckwheat. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I like that. That's really cool. Thanks. Yeah. His head does look like skin. It's not skin. Uh -huh. That would be horrifying. Yeah, I, was about, I was like, ooh, <laughs> oof. It's a, it's a sack, mm -hmm. like, sewed down the middle. Right, I it's can like see. It's like a burlap sack. I can see scar, yeah. Okay. I don't know what's going on with his eyes. Uh -huh. Maybe there's a soul I in mean, there somewhere. I mean, he's animated, so I guess you could just say it. Yeah. Like, yeah, right? I don't know why I didn't think about overalls. <laughs> like, <laughs> it, it never came to mind. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, cool. Yeah, is that it? Yeah, I think, I think that's, that's it. it. Yeah, we did it. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Want to do do your uh, outro? Uh, sh uh, you mean the outro I don't have? Sure. Well, no, I mean like, <laughs> but... like, like thanks guys and all that kind of stuff. Yeah, no, I, <laughs> it's just I don't have a script ever. Okay. So um, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Um, this has been Maddie, and you want to plug your channel one more time? Oh, sure. Uh, yeah, you can check out my channel, Vitamin Dieter. Uh, I have a couple videos up, a couple D&D &D stuff, like some, like one or two reviews. I don't know if I have another review up, but um, yeah. <laughs> go, <laughs> go check out if you want, you know, like, uh, I'm sure I'll yeah, be glad I don't to know see you there. When, I don't know which video is coming up first, mm -hmm. um, but... His, we, do, we do have a video over on his channel of this, but with other characters. But yeah, that, this, was, this was really fun. Uh, th thanks for inviting me to your channel. Thanks for drawing with no me. No problem. And we'll see. We'll, uh... I just realized, I don't know if I told you thanks for inviting me onto your channel on your video, so <laughs> now I feel bad. No, um, no. I'm just going to say it here for the record. <laughs> it's like, I'm going to Thank make you it for inviting clear. me onto your channel. <laughs> yes. Uh, I'm, I'm sure okay, people cool. will forgive you. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Yeah, well, uh, I think that's it. Thanks for watching, guys. I will see you in the next video. Bye. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>